Hello ladies and gents, welcome back to another video. I'm out here on a hike with Kyle and we have climbed and gained some elevation. I'm talking like a thousand vertical feet for some dumb deer sheds. I don't know why I, I go so high on these ranges to go find deer sheds. We're in deer shed country so we're looking for deer sheds. Kyle likes deer sheds and the spot, this spot is kind of close to home so Figured we'd hit it, but you know who I am. I love elk sheds, but here we are finding deer sheds. But like I said, climbed our way to the top and wow, that is uh, that is a good start. That is definitely a very nice mule deer shed. Definitely a nice four point. Let me, uh, let me show you. But look at that thing. That is a stud and he has a big old base on him, nice little eye guard. That G2 is at least 17 inches right there. Doesn't have the biggest front fork, but that's impressive. That's a nice deer shed right there. Let's go ahead and pick this bad boy up. Oh, oh, I can't even fit him in the frame. Holy smokies. He actually grew a little bit when you pick him up and you, you turn him like that. Oh my goodness. That is a big deer. <laughs> let's find his other side. We'll put him on the Scout to Hunt app and let's try to find his other side. Holy cow, guys. That thing is a toad. Let's see how long his G2 is. That's like almost an 18 inch G2. Holy shnikes. And look at that eye guard. Look at that buck. Like, I seriously can't get him in the frame like that. <laughs> Woo! Let's find the other side. So I was back up here, decided to take the drainage down, and I just stumbled upon that guy right there. He's old. Old, but look at the mass on that. Ooh. That G2 kept growing. Dang. That's actually pretty massy solid three right there that main beam is long decent little eye guard on him G4 is broken but he has a little kink right there but not a bad three-point right there we will take that put him on the app and keep going down this thick little drainage right here see if we can pull out some more guys I was literally side hilling and stepped on that G2 right there and it picked the base up and it made a noise and I was like that sounded like an antler look down yep we've got an old chalky three another old guy and another left side all lefts today we gotta match something up in here got a lot of country and making glass for days up in here too so that's what I'm gonna do is just sit and pick it apart and just go back and forth and grid it all the way down with my glass same with over here so see if we can pick something up well guys I was just right back there picked up this guy came you know like 30 yards we got another one right there on the same hillside another left I have four lefts where are the big ones where are the browns are they down here or are they gonna be up there who knows but let's do some more glassing all right guys, I literally just sat down, pulled my glass up, and not even five seconds, I glassed up a right side across the way. I walked above it earlier, and it could be Big Dog's other side. I can't really tell, but ooh, but we got another one, so that's, that's five. We're killing it. All right guys, I had to work my way all the way back halfway up the same face that I was up higher, where I found Big Dog, and... I honestly think this might be his other side. I really hope so, because that's a sweet deer. And that would be a sweet set to have. But that's why you always glass back across, because I went around and I was back over here on that side, glass back across below where I had walked previously. Sure enough, I think I matched up big dog, but still got a good climb to go get him. Guys, it's big dog. <laughs> I matched up the very first one from this morning that has the 18 inch G2, matched him up. No way, he actually was clear up the top and might, I mean, he must have just worked his way across down to here and here he is. I'll show, I'll turn this around and I'll show you guys. 
Look at that. Look at that stud. Oh my goodness. Another big G2 on this side. He's a little broken on his main beam, but that is a stud right there. That's a stud set. Let me put the camera down and I'll pick him up for you guys. <sighs> Alright guys, here's that first one I found. Just giant G2. Just big. And then, here's his other side. That's not a bad buck right there. Not a bad buck. This side's a little bit bigger. A little bit more mass, but I'm not going to complain with that whatsoever. Heck yeah. That buck is sweet. We will take that all day. I'm so glad we matched him up. Gotta love it. Let's go find some more. Alright guys, back over here glassing. Glass this guy up. Decent little four. Nice little eye guard on him. We'll take that. Heck yeah. Keep on traveling this way. See what else we can find. Found that last shed right by the tree, right over there. And walked over. I'm trying to go up this hill actually. And walked up on him, but trying to go that way. Let's see what else we can find over there. Back up there. Glass this guy. Chalky deuce. Old. Came all the way back down to the bottom. Now I need to gain all my elevation. Back up there. Here we go. Was sitting clear up there. Glass that guy up. Nice little hard white. Four. Can't complain with that. Heck yeah. Very nice. Need to match him up. We're gonna venture that way and do some glass and see what else we can turn up. Well, just made it back to the truck right there. Yes, we did a pretty solid day. I think I found 11. Kyle found, what, 15? I dig it. Let's lay them out. All right, for starters, we got the sorry people down in the front. Little chalk donkeys. And we got some twos. That's a nice one. Set that Kyle found. Some good twos. Got some decent fours right there. Nice three that Kyle found set. And he has a couple years off the same buck right there. That's all the same buck right there. And there's that. And then one that I just found last right there. The set. And then Kyle found a badass one. Look at this thing. Look at all the junk back there. Like what is happening? And he just has a weird looking frame. He's just cool and I told you guys this set was actually pretty decent. And he is. He is a decent set. 18 inch G2s. I'm thinking he's like 170 almost on the dot. If not 170, high 160s. So, hell of a day. 25 sheds. Even calling it early. Yeah. I like it. Starting to get yeah, I'm, I'm ready to freak out. They want to drink my sweat. Oh, <laughs> that's successful sweat, baby. Oh yeah. Thanks for the hike, brother. <laughs> yeah, of course, Doug. We'll definitely have to do it again. One last look. Appreciate you guys watching. If you haven't yet, go check out the new swag over at risingshed.com. And just everything that you guys do is greatly appreciated. So just thank you so very much. And he's just on his phone back there, just loser guy. But <laughs> I love you guys. We'll see you on the next one.